So, I am gonna be making a pine and derby today. You need that, a block of wood, a hammer, instructions, hey guys. four wheels, stickers, and four nails. Hey guys! And that's what we're gonna be doing. So, mm -hmm. today I'm just gonna be showing my ideas. Okay, so that's what I'm gonna be doing. So, here's my idea. And I was thinking of cutting a truck down right there and cutting down a little right there over there, then making it go out and cutting out a little hole and taking out just a little bit of the top. And I'll be cutting down right there. If it's really heavy, then it might just win because it needs the heavier it, it is, the faster it goes. So that's pretty much my idea. With my head in the clouds and my feet on the map, we go chasing the sun and we'll follow the map. When this world's got me feeling small, I'll be sure to tell my story whenever our adventure comes. Then all the way to there, and then fill it up with all pennies and quarters and stuff. Ooh, that'd be pretty heavy. We can only do five ounces. That's the mm -hmm. limit. So, so what? How, what? Many, how many coins is five ounces? This is probably pretty close to five ounces mm -hmm. already, just by itself. It is. So this is what I'd suggest. Imagine the car of your dreams. Seriously, like, like think about this. You can make it go up and come up, and then have a windshield. That's where all the bugs splat. And you can see it when they're driving. So you can see outside of it. You could have like a cool thing that comes back and maybe a fin. This is a really cool thing. If you want it to go faster, what you do is you make sure that it has weight on the top side of the car when it's going down. So you'll want this back side probably to be uh, on the top. I think I'm Because that's more weight. Because this is what? When it comes down on the track, it goes and falls down, right? And it pushes it. That's right. The weight of it being higher up, if there's more weight higher up, the longer time it has to fall down and push it farther. Smart. That's right. I remember you telling me that. Mm -hmm. I forgot about it. And then another secret <laughs> is when we're putting on the wheels, you want to put on three wheels all on the same angle, touching the ground, and one, one wheel slightly up. I know that sounds really weird, but what it does is it actually makes it have less surface drag. Because if all four oh wheels are touching, God. then it actually makes it so it's it's slowing it down. But if only three are touching, it'll go a little bit faster. The most or important else. thing about this is that James has to be the one to build it. Exactly. So do you That's have a clamp or something that we can use and help him saw it out? I do. Do you want me to go get it? In the garage or, or in your- Upstairs. Okay. I'll go get it. Let's do it. But, but I really want you to design a awesome car. So do, should we get a piece of paper and have him draw a picture? It would actually be good to draw right on this side, just right how you want it. But remember, this should probably be the back side. This is the front. Front, back. Okay. I'll be right back. I'm not known for my engineering prowess, but Ryan is. I'm gonna kind of help where needed, but mostly I think Ryan's gonna be the best coach for James. Make sure they come up with the most epic Pinewood Derby ever. He'll probably help you with the designing. Even if you draw it, you might change it a little bit. That's okay. Ooh, I like it, I like it. Also, you know what's a really good thing to do too? Oh. Graphite, powdered graphite on the wheels makes they go, them go faster. Is that like dry lubricant? Mm -hmm. Okay. We'll probably want it to put it on its side for now. All right, I'm gonna clamp it so it's slightly on this side so we can work on sawing it first. Make it so it has a really cool. Well, let's put a fin right there. A fin? If you'd make it just really blunt like that, that that'll stop the airflow. So let's make it so it goes like steep. Just saw it like this, up and down, and try and follow the line. Yeah, be careful. Don't touch. Oh, get in there. Oh, oh, you did it! Smooth it up. Yeah, good, good job. I go a little bit in front of the corner and try and make a scoop out of it. Yeah! 
James is over here sanding away, and I, I got a Dremel so we could hopefully go a little faster, huh? This has sandpaper on it. You don't want to touch it when it's spinning. See when it's spinning? It can do this, watch. And so it can also sand your finger if you're not careful. Do you want to use it? No, it's kind of scary. Yes, it's kind of scary, and good thing you have goggles on. Ready? I let go. Sanding yeah. it down real good. Oh, that is looking terrific. Isn't that cool? Now, we were thinking about adding some headlights right Head here. Okay. Wheel. With some screws. Oh, that's cool. Wheel. So how we're gonna do it. I'll give it a little weight too. I'll, I'll probably be drilling it, but then you can use this to put it, screw it in. So you're just gonna drill the hole and then he's gonna screw yeah. it in. Okay, so, good. But we can't drill into this line. Right. that's for the tires. Right. This is kind of a little bit scary part, so let's right not, there. Let's not do it in here, let's go downstairs. Good idea. What's up, buddy? What's next? Painting the car red and blue. Painting it red and blue, huh? We got the headlights in, and now we're gonna paint this sucker. Very cool. He's gonna do a really good job. really good. And I found some glow in the dark orange paint and I put it on those. Oh, you have orange paint that's glow in the dark for the headlights, huh? <laughs> Poor Charlie's under attack. <laughs> Joy, did you beat it? She got the other one. <gasps> Help me! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mama, are you torturing Charlie? Am I torturing you? <laughs> No! <laughs> Do you like it? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> That's cute. Well, James is almost done. He's putting the stickers on his car now. It's 95, just like Lightning. Lightning McQueen, that's right. That's a good number. That's a good number, that's right. He's a winning number, huh? Here's what we gotta do now. Now that you've got it all painted, yeah. and it's looking real good, now we just need to add the wheels. So, so you got... do we put these yeah. in and then okay. hammer? That's exactly right. So you just take the wheel, and you put it on the nail, and then you just tap it in there. Nice and easy. Now, hey, let me ask you a question. James, do you wanna do this right now with me, or do you wanna wait until Ryan can help you? Ryan might make it go faster. Ryan, Ryan. We do we wanna wait? Ryan. We might have to wait until tomorrow if we're gonna wait then. Wait, Ryan actually said you should ask Grandpa if he's gonna be gone. Okay, do you wanna go ask Grandpa right now? Yeah. Let's go ask him. Pick this up. Okay, you bring the hammer, Ellie. Let's go ask Grandpa. And hey, don't torture that poor boy too much, okay? okay. He's just a baby. All right, what do you think, Grandpa? Okay, let me show you what you can do. Okay. If you take a look real close, look down inside on the back part of the head of that, there's two spots. Metal that's been squeezed up. Can okay. You, can you see it? That has to be sanded down, otherwise that will dig into the tire and slow it down. Interesting. And so you take and you sand that off, that's where you begin. You okay. Get that cleaned up, and then you'll be able to have that less drag. Okay. I and mean, then once you get that done, then we put graphite on those. Okay. Work the wheels so that they get graphite in it nice and good and that way it'll go better. Okay. Now, when is the Pinewood Derby? Tomorrow night. Okay, so it's gotta be done today then. Yeah. Ryan's not here right now, so we're gonna see if maybe we can use his Dremel when he gets home tonight. James is still working on it hard, trying to make sure he gets a good file on it. Actually, 
No, I think it's definitely working. It's just kind of slow. And then we're almost done. Then we just need graphite on this thing and I think it's it. James, we're gonna finish your awesome, cool Pinewood Derby tomorrow. Yeah. And then tomorrow you guys will get to see James's awesome Pinewood Derby in the race. And I yeah, think it's gonna be really good. Be? How big will it be? There's gonna be a lot of people there. So make sure to tune in tomorrow, guys, for James's awesome Pinewood Derby. It's gonna be really good, and I think you're gonna do really good. You built that, and you worked really hard today, and I'm super proud of how hard you worked, and how much effort and energy you made it into that, making it the best one there is. So we'll find out tomorrow how it goes. We'll see you guys tomorrow, and have an awesome day. Pause the game. When we were kids, just hanging at the playground, when all we